you do it? Uh, I want to throw them uh, on that table. This one, put that one over here. We just rearranging the house? What's up everybody? Today we're gonna to be filming a very special St. Patrick's Day video with the most time-honored tradition from the Emerald Isles. I'm talking, of course, about the Irish car bomb. Now, I hope you enjoyed this video. We haven't seen it yet because it hasn't been shot, but if it's anything like I'm thinking it's gonna turn out, it's gonna be a good one. Thanks for watching. Got a soft box overhead. Um, these lights are about the cheapest ones I could find on Amazon. It was like 100 bucks for a can of five, and that includes that backdrop with the three different color. I don't know what those are, but they're cheap, and I would recommend getting a paper backdrop if you have the money. Uh, at any rate, what I did was replace standard CFL bulbs that came with this with a couple of these bad boys. These are 750 watt equivalent corn cob lights. They're LED. You'll see the difference here between this light. It's no Aperture 120D, but it's pretty bright for what we need. Compared to this soft box with a 60 watt equivalent. Now, that's a great kind of fill light, but uh, as you can tell, it's just nowhere near as powerful. So, 35 bucks for a two pack of these changes your whole lighting situation for cheap, cheap. Now, it's important when you're shooting with glass that you always want to wipe your glass. Don't forget kids, never leave the house without wiping your glass first. It's also very important to not drink what we're about to make. Uh, once you've cleaned the glass, I'm going to anyway, but I'm a trained professional. Do not do this at home. All right, first thing, kids, is very most important is to get your exposure set. Um, obviously, I'm shooting with the Canon M50. This is the 50 millimeter Yong Duo lens. I probably butchered that, so I apologize. Um, it's a decent lens. Uh, I would like to see how it stacks up against the Canon Nifty 50, so expect that video as soon as I get 150 bucks for that lens. Um, got a very nice f1.8. Uh, probably not going to shoot that low. I do plan to do a video stacking up the Canon M50 against the iPhone 11 Pro Max, which is what I have. Which is what this is being recorded on now just for the fun of it. All right, so our first shot is gonna be one of the most probably complicated shots 
anyone has ever gotten. An empty beer glass, no movement, nothing else in the scene, just the glass. Um, the plan is, is we're gonna have the bottles appear out from behind on each side. I think we're gonna do that fishing line. Let's go ahead and get this out of the way first. Not you. <laughs> That's why you're supposed to drink it immediately. <laughs> oh. oh my God, don't drink more. <laughs> Now have a bunch of coins pop in the air because why not? It'll look cool, I think. Uh, trick I learned from Daniel Schiffer: take the stuff in a little bag and pop it up like that. Works beautifully.
So behind the scenes footage, what'd you do to get in here? Memphis, what'd you do? Did you move the camera? Yeah, you moved the camera, didn't you? No.